In June 15, I made this circle, and um, I guess you know where this is going. That's right, I made a hundred games, of course, because every single semester, I think, we could say semester, we'll do this. And um, it's pretty fun, I would say, so it, this is an interesting cast. So I guess so let's start off with mentioning everyone in each district. Before this video starts, I just want to announce that my new single with Jonathan Matthews, Sipping Codeine, is now out everywhere. That's right, you can now stream it on Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube Music, wherever it is, you can now finally listen to the song. This is one of the first songs we've ever recorded in a home studio, so if you can just stream it like once or twice and many more times if you want, please do. Either it's on Spotify or Apple Music, your support will help us a lot. Thank you all for listening and now enjoy this video. District 1. We got me, Retro, RC, and Sticky. Now, the three of us might know each other, but and Sticky might know these two. So I guess that's why I put them in the same district. District 2, we got Piley, Caesar Fever, Nonsense, and Cloudfo. And uh I just realized this now, but Caesar Fever follows Piley, and I that that that, that caught me off guard actually. Next one, District Three. We got Rareblin, Dubicus, Professor Bonnie, and Seabow. I don't know if they know each other, but I probably think they do. Uh, next one we got District Four: Ginger Brave, Mike Geno, Burger, and the Voice Guy. I have no idea what I did here. But this is an interesting one though. We just got Ginger Brave coming back in in the next one. And uh, we got these three. Which is a pretty interesting, I will say. District 5, we got Lil Nas X, Wheat Skins, Jay Shohat, and Nugget. These two being in the same district is not a coincidence. <laughs> Since Weed Skins follows Lil Nas X, and uh, pretty much he's in the second circle, he got in, I guess. District 6, we got Innuendo, Ziffy, Ethan the Doodler, and Muggo. Now, these two are in the same team, I don't know about Innuendo and Muggo, but they're both all FNF related, so we added them in, in the same thing, same district. Now. The district below are gonna be the ones that are that can't be put anywhere in the uh, in the other districts. So District Seven: Blue Sinai, Tooney, Katie, and Nilo. Uh, yeah. I mean, these are this is interesting. We just got a, a one FNF person and like three like artists. District Eight: We got Bia, Dexter, Rebe, and Scoop. Again, this is a pretty interesting cast since each of them are like different in their own thing. I don't know, but they're each different. District 9, we got Glibo, Noxy, Patricia A or Patricia, and V. Uh, yeah, again, pretty different, all of them. Pretty, pretty different. District 10, we got Nowhere, Nowhere, I, I, I Nowhere? I don't know, man. I just call you Nowhere. Contagious, Girl, and Ruby. Yeah, there's, there's a person named Girl, just trust me on this one. Next one, we got District 11. Davy, Vixios, Dioma, and Saruki. Dioma and Saruki, well, they're both in FNF, and Vixios and Davy isn't. So, yeah. District 12, we got. What the fuck? Zach, Alex Hirsch, and Jack Manifold. Now, this, this is what I call interesting. <laughs> And so, that's exactly the entire cast. Now, I need to get a bit more closer because I don't think everyone can see this. Now, profile pictures, retros, profile pictures, should, you know, it had to become with this YouTube one because, you know, this Twitter one isn't him. And then we got, you know, I just realized Puffo changed his profile picture, like, he has now have, like, a blue hat on him. Uh, and then we got an, a cat and a dog. Interesting. We got Ginger Brave in the middle, and also Bonnie having this. Um... Well, let's count all the sketches, shall we? Let's count all sketches, all profile picture sketches. One, two, 
three, four, five. We got five people with sketches as their profile picture. And I know because of like having a coffee thing decided to put as a profile picture. Okay then. And Reby, I can't seem to find like a normal profile picture, so I just go ahead and use what she has on their Twitter. Um, which is a fall guys of her. Hi. Moving on. Um, yeah, and it is what the fuck here. I have no idea how he got in here, but um, they're here, I guess. Alright, so I think we're ready to see this these people get into action. Let's proceed. The bloodbath. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. What the fuck? Grabs a shield leaning on the cornucopia. Cluffo grabs a backpack, not realizing it is empty. Okay. Contag Contagious runs away from the cornucopia. Muggle finds a bag full of explosives. Reblin grabs a jar of fishing bait while Davy gets fishing gear. Alright, let's, let's see what they're doing here. Alex Hirsch one, runs away from the cornucopia. Ruby stays at the cornucopia for resources. Piley grabs a backpack not realizing it's empty. Toonie snatches a pair of sighs. Oh wow. Okay. Mike Jenna runs away from the cornucopia. Girl runs away from the cornucopia. Innuendo runs away from the cornucopia. Luna Zex breaks Katie's nose for a basket of bread. <laughs> Damn, Lonas, I have no idea you're getting this competitive. Uh, RC runs away from the cornucopia. Professor Bunny runs away from the cornucopia. I can't. Why did I say? Why did I say it like that? Retro runs away from the cornucopia. Zack, Duplicus, and Dexter get into a fight. Duplicus triumphantly kills them both. <laughs> Man, rest in peace, Zach and, Zach and Dexter, Jesus Christ. Uh, next one. Reeby breaks Sticky's nose for a basket of bread. Well, this is interesting. <laughs> Nugget runs away from the cornucopia. Weeskins finds a bag full of explosives. Vixius and Scoop fight for a bag. Scoop gives up and retreats. Yeah, Vixius, I, I know, I know, I know, I know you're so, you're so Minecraft. Caesar Fever and Gl Glibo fight Ziffy and nonsense. Caesar Fever and Glibo survive. I never thought Ziffy and nonsense would die sooner. Rest in peace, Ziffy and nonsense. Nazi finds a canteen full of water. Nowhere finds a bag full of explosives. Saruki runs away from the cornucopia. Puppet for Patricia and Ethan the Doodler work together to get as many supplies as possible. Them. Well, this is an interesting team, I guess. Uh, Ginger Brave runs away from the cornucopia. V runs away from the cornucopia. Nago runs away from the cornucopia. Burger runs away from the cornucopia. The voice guy runs away from the cornucopia. Jack Manifold runs away from the cornucopia. J Shot runs away from the cornucopia. Via strangles Seafowl after engaging in a fist fight. <laughs> oh well, rest in peace, Seafowl. The Dioma. Dioma grabs a backpack. Alright, Dioma, Dioma, I don't know. Di Dioma. Dioma grabs a backpack and retreats. Blue Sinai clutches the first aid kit and runs away. Proceed. Day one, Rebe injures herself. Okay, um, wow, alright. Divicus makes a wooden spear. Innuendo receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. The voice guy sprains his ankle while running away from school. <laughs> yeah, I would run away if this guy's gonna come after me. Dioma, Via, and Piley hunt for other tributes. This team, this thingy is so different. I, I don't know. Blue Sina travels to higher ground. Alex Hurst receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Toonie goes hunting. Jack Manifold overhears my genuine nugget talking in the distance. Jack Manifold about to do something, I can tell. Muggle begs for Davy to kill him. He refuses, keeping Muggle alive. Holy crap. Nilo makes a wooden spear. Papa foot pushes as I always do, baby. All in Texas, baby, get me again. We always be fishing with the boy. Patricia chases Professor Bunny. <laughs> Puffo tries to sleep through the entire day. Alright, Clapo. Vixius travels to higher ground. Noxie makes a slingshot. Ginger Brave receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Sticky and V work together for the day. Okay, the... Alright, that's nice. Ruby travels to higher ground. 
Wheat skin is contagious, eats in the doodler, and a burger. Hunt for other tributes. Um Yeah, this is um this is interesting. <laughs> Wheat skins is the only person that isn't FNF related here. Yeah. Uh Luna Six tries to spear fish with a trident. Okay. RC and Rare Blind work together for a day. Okay, okay, this is this is good. This is good. Katie hunts for other tributes. Dash Lab practices his archery. Caesar Fever receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Glibo steals from girl while she isn't looking. Nice one, Glibo. <laughs> retro questions his sanity. Damn, Retro. What the fuck discovers a cave? <laughs> Saruki receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Nowhere picks flowers. Proceed. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Okay. Let's rest in peace. Let's say rest in peace to Zack, Dexter, Ziffy, Nonsense, and Seapal. This is literally getting interesting. Let's see everyone's status real quick. Jesus, Caesar Fever has two kills. Damn. Okay, but yeah, Nonsense is dead. Wait a minute, wait. Caesar Fever killed Nonsense. <laughs> And they're in the same district, that's it, that, okay, Dubicus, uh, yeah, two kills too, that's interesting. Ziffy is deceased in District 6, Dexter is the only one deceased in District 8, and District 12 only has Zach deceased, alright, let's go. Night 1, Ginger Braves kills Innuendo with a sickle. Off, off to a good start. <laughs> <laughs> Rest in peace, Innuendo. You just got killed by a goddamn cookie. Saruki dies trying to escape the arena. Oh, damn. Rest in peace, Saruki. Noxy begs for Ethan the Doodler to kill her. He refuses, keeping Noxy alive. Uh, Alright. Vixius climbs a tree to rest. Uh huh. Patricia loses sight of where she is. Okay. Nowhere dies from hypothermia. Hey, you're not the only one that died from hypothermia. <laughs> the voice guy quietly hums. Dubicus passes out from exhaustion. Now, I don't know if he died, but um, he passes out, so he's not, I think. I guess. So, uh, yeah. Glibo and girls sleep in ships. Hmm, uh, alright. Interesting. Truly an interesting. Deshlap tends to retro his wound. Oh, wow, okay, helping a man out, huh, Deshlap? Clapo thinks about home. Oh, alright. Rare Balloon begs for Toonie to kill him. He, she refuses, keeping Rare Balloon alive. Huh, alright. Nugget and Reby tell stories about themselves to each other. Actually, this would be an interesting talk, I will say. I want to know what about what it's about though. Dioma begs for Burger to kill him. He refuses keeping Dioma alive. Alright, Dioma lives another day. Wow. Jack Manifold cooks his food before putting his fire out. Okay. Weedskins attempts to start a fire, but it's unsuccessful. Oh. Okay, well. I, I guess that's um surprising. <laughs> Contagious defeats Scoop in a fight, but spares his life. Holy shit, Contagious, you're manning up yourself. What the fuck? Blue Cyanide thinks about winning. Of course, uh, he always does. Professor Bonnie is awoken by nightmares. I mean, that's my reaction when I'm awoken by nightmares, too. Alex Hurst looks at the night sky, alright? VRC Davian, what the fuck? Sleeping shifts. Oh, alright, this is interesting. <laughs> Vicky and V run into each other and decide to truce for a night. Um, I don't know if they have any relationships, but damn okay. Muggle tends to Piley's wounds. Alright. Ruby cries herself to sleep. Mike Jenna thinks about winning, of course. Lona Sex receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Okay. Caesar Fever screams for help. Of course, of course, that's what Caesar people would do. Anyways, I want to show you guys something. I don't know. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Shelton fighting his de- ah! I don't know. Of course, oh, there, there you, you go. <laughs> there you go, guys. He screams every day. Shout out to this account, though. Papa Poop tends to his wounds. Alright. Katie loses sight of where they is. It's not she. I, I just- they, they, they just really put it there because they don't have a day, okay? Sorry. Nilo passes out from exhaustion. Alright, proceed. Piley scares the voice guy off. Okay. Interesting. Caesar Fever receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Okay. Wheat skins poisons Duplicus's drink, but mistakes it for his own and dies. No. Rest in peace, Wheat skins. 
Oh man. RC sets an explosive box, killing puppet flip. No, what the fuck? I thought we were supposed to be puppet mates. <laughs> that metaphor practices his archery. Alright? I don't know why I said it like that, but okay. Ethan the Dedoodler discovers a cave. Nyla receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Okay. Girl sprains her ankle while running away from Noxie. Huh. Uh, okay. Clafo runs away from school. You know you're terrifying if Clafo runs away from you. <laughs> Contagious stabs Nugget while her back is turned. Well, rest in peace, Nugget. Damn, that sucks. Lona sexy smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Okay, Lonas. V is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Oh, I don't know if he died, but um, I don't think he's dead, so yeah. Moving on. What the fuck makes a wind spear? <laughs> Mike, Jeno, Davy, Katie, Professor Bonnie, and V a hunt for other trivia. I don't know why I said prof professor or whatever. But yeah, this is interesting. Um, I don't know what will the interaction is going to be, but yeah, okay. Alex hurts to construct a shack, okay? Please don't make it the mystery shack, because you're gonna make another Gravity Falls with it, okay? Rebel and Ruby, Ginger Brave, and Retro raid Sticky's camp while he is hunting. Oh, oh damn, alright. This is an interesting thing, Ginger Brave leading the army. <laughs> reading the- uh, <laughs> leading the FNF squad. <laughs> Dioma picks flowers. Okay. Ruby sprains her ankle while running away from Vixios. What the fuck this is this? It's not a ma manhunt, bro. Further scares Toonie off. I don't know if that's gonna happen. Toonie looks exactly terrified at that profile picture, I think. Patricia receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Okay. Muggle collects fruit from a tree. Mm -hmm. Jay Schlapp picks flowers. Oh, damn. Being peaceful now. Damn, this is crazy. Blue Sinai attacks Glibo, but he manages to escape. Oh my god, Blue Sinai. Really. Really. Proceed. Arena event. A swarm of Tracker Jackers invades the arena. While running away from the Tracker Jackers, Vio grabs V and throws him to the ground. <laughs> what type of fucking betrayal is this? Note that their names are literally one letter different. Okay. <laughs> That's what is interesting. What the fuck survives? Alright. Highly knocks Onas X unconscious and leaves him there as bait. <laughs> oh, oh. R.I.P. Onas X. Rest in peace. While running away from the tracker jackers, Burger grabs Ruby and throws her to the ground. Oh damn. Okay, rest in peace, Ruby. Katie and Vixios run out of places to run and are stung to death. <laughs> rest in peace, Katie and Vixios. Man. Scoop knocks Ethan the Doodler unconscious and leaves him there as bait. God fucking damn it, Scoop. Sticky and Caesar Fever run out of places to run and are stumped to death. Well, what? Re damn, okay. Uh, two people from the fun gang is dead. Um, rest in peace, Sticky and Caesar Fever. Man. While running away from the tracker jackers, Davy grabs Blue Sinai and throws him to the ground. Rest in peace, Blue. Your time of uh, shine is over. Nilo survives, alright. Ginger Brave survives, okay. Axe Hurst knocks Jay Shred unconscious and leaves him there at- Oh, fuck! God damn it, man. Uh, rest in peace, Jay Shred. This is- this is an honestly crazy moment here. Noxy survives, okay. Dioma survives, or Dioma. Professor Bonnie survives, okay. Duplicate survives. Rareblin is stung to death, okay. Rest in peace, Rareblin. Glibo is stung to death on uh, Rest in Peace Glibo. The voice guy survives. Patricia knocks Reby unconscious and leaves her there as bait. Rest in peace, Reby. God damn it. Clafo and Arcee run out of places to run and are stung to death. Well, now there are no longer puppets in this game. Retro survives, okay. While running away from the tracker jackers, Toonie grabs Girl and throws her to the ground. <laughs> Rest in peace, Girl. God damn. Tuni, you are a menace, okay? You are a damn menace. Jack Manifold survives, alright? Contagious and Mike Jenner run out of places to run and are stung to death. Rest in peace, Contagious and Mike Jenner. Mago is stung to death. Rest in peace, Mago. Proceed. 25 cannon star shots can be heard in the distance? Holy fuck. Jesus Christ, dude. 
That's a lot. Oh my god. Rest in peace to Inuendo, Saruki, Nowhere, Weightskins, Me, Nugget, V, Lil Nas X, Ruby, Haiti, Pixios, Ethan the Doodler, Sticky, Caesar Fever, Blue Cyanite, Jay Schlatt, Rare Blim, Glibo, Rebe, Lafo, RC, Girl, Contagious, Mike Geno, and Marco. Alright, uh, let's see everyone's status. So we got uh, all of the Trick 2 died, except for Piley. That's that's interesting. And then we got Professor Bonnie in here and all that. We got Mike Geno, the only one in District 4 here. And then we got all District 5 dead. Jesus, oh my god, bro. And then, oh, District, District 6 too? Okay, um, and we got Toonie and Milo being the only ones alive in District 7. That's interesting. And we got Via and Scoop, the only one on District 8. Then we got Noxie and Patricia and the only one in District 9. Oh, District 10 is dead, literally. And then, uh, they mean the Dioma, or Dioma, proceed. Night 2, Burger thinks about home. Alright. Davy stabs Piley with a tree band. Branch, I mean. Oh, wow. Rest in peace, Piley. The boy's guy tends to his wounds. Ginger Brave and Professor Bonnie run into each other and decide to choose for a night. Okay. <laughs> Alright, oh, oh god, that's great to hear. Duplicates and Jack Manifold hold hands. Uh, okay, um, Nilo attempts to start a fire, but it's unsuccessful, okay. Patricia looks at the nice guy. Retro severely injures what the fuck, but puts him out of his misery. Rest in peace, what the fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Noxy destroys two new supplies while she is asleep, okay. Via loses sight of where she is. Alex hurts cooks his food before putting his fire out, Dioma asks questions in sanity, Scoop dies from hunger. Rest in peace, Scoop. <laughs> Damn, didn't know he gonna go, 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 go on too soon, bro. Proceed. The feast. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memorials from the tribute's families. Jack Manifold kills Gingerbread with a hatchet. <laughs> okay, get rest in peace, Gingerbread. That was quick. Professor Bonnie decides not to go to the feast. Okay. Ice hurts, strikes down, and kills Dioma. Well, rest in peace, Dioma. Burger decides not to go to the feast. Via decides not to go to the feast. Retro decides not to go to the feast. Nilo sets an explosive off, killing Dubicus, Patricia, and Noxie. What the fuck, Nilo? Wow. What a fucking menace. The voice guy decides not to go to the feast. Okay. Davy and Toonie get into a fight over raw meat, but Davy gives up and runs away. That's what I see. That's what I like to see, Toonie. That's what I like to see. Proceed. Davy attacks Burger, but he manages to escape. The voice guy sees smoke rising in distance, but decides not to investigate. Alright. Via fishes. Okay. Retro Alex Hurch and Jack Manifold hunt for other tributes. Oh, this is pretty interesting. I'm gonna lie. Professor Bonnie thinks about home. Nilo steals from Toonie while she isn't looking. Okay, now he's on Nilo's on the fucking crazy mode here. Jesus Christ. Proceed. Arena event. A cloud of poisonous smoke starts to fill the arena. Retro slowly pushes Nilo closer into the ground until he can't resist anymore. Rest in peace, Nilo. Oh my god. Oh, his rampage is done. That's what I'm all saying. Davis survives. Okay. Burger and Jack Manifold agree to die in the cloud together, but Burger pushes Jack Manifold in without warning. Holy shit. Rest in peace, Jack Manifold. Burger, holy crap, why would you do that? Via survives. Professor Bonnie and the voice guy decides to run into the cloud together. Rest in peace, Professor Bonnie and the voice guy. Really glad, really sad to see. Alex Hurst survives. Toonie survives. Let's proceed. Well, kind of shots can be heard in the distance. Rest in peace, Piley. What the fuck? Scoop. Ginger Brave. Dioma. Dubicus. Patricia. Noxie. Nilo. Jack Manifold. Professor Bonnie. And the voice guy. Alright, let's see everyone's status. Holy fuck. Everyone is dead. We got Burglar, the only one alive in District 4. District 7, we only got Toonie alive. Alright, District 8, we've only got Via alive. District 11, we got Davey. And then District 12, we got Alex Hurts. Alright, um, this is interesting. 
We are, we're down to the last five. Let's go back and proceed. Night three, Alex Hurts tries to sing himself to sleep. Okay. Burger and Toonie talks about the tribute still alive. I don't know why I said that in S. But okay, this is actually pretty cool. Via begs for Retro the Killer. He refuses keeping Via alive. Oh, damn. Okay. Uh, Davy tries to treat his infection. Alright, let's proceed. Day 4. Toonie, Alex Hurts, Via, and Davy raid Burger's camp while he is hunting. Okay. Wow, everyone is getting up on Burger, huh? Also, I said the last five, but I think it's just the last six now. Retro searches for firewood. Okay. No cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Alright, let's proceed. Night 4. Alex Hurts and Via run into each other and decide to truce for a night. Okay. Burger attempts to start a fire, but it's unsuccessful. Retro, Davy, and Toonie discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Why? Why has there no fucking bad thing happen to him? There's no, like, fucking evil things. Alright, let's proceed. Day 5. Toonie questions her sanity. Okay. Retro strangles Alex Hirsch after engaging in a fist fight. Okay, finally, about time we got some action. <laughs> Rest in peace, Alex. Jesus. Burger falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Holy crap, another one. Oh, rest in peace, Burger. Davy cannot handle the circumstances and commit suicide. Okay, we are having too much now. <laughs> it's... <laughs> Via questions or sanity. Oh my god, we're down to the last three. Three cannon shots can be heard in distance. Rest in peace, Alex Hurts. Burger. And Davy. Okay, let's see everyone's status. We're down to Retro, Toonie, and Via. Who are these three that are gonna get? Are gonna do it? Okay. I'm thinking Toonie. I'm 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 rooting for Toonie here, because Toonie is pretty cool. I say, I would say, pretty cool person. All right, uh, let's proceed. Night five. Via thinks about winning. Okay. Retro kills Toonie with her own weapon. Just when I thought I was gonna. Do oh my god. All right. Rest in peace, Toonie. Oh my god, I was vouching for her, man. Retro, why you gotta do it? Day 6, Via bleeds out due to untreated injuries? Wait. Proceed. Two can shots can be heard in distance, rest in peace, Toonie and Via, but... Ladies and gents, congratulations, Retro. Congratulations, Retro, you did it. You have won this semester's Hunger Games. Quite a surprise, actually. <laughs> but yeah, wow. Congrats. Let's proceed. There's everyone's placements if you want to see where you at, if you are my mutual, of course. But okay, yeah, here's everyone. Damn. And this is the summary. Go on and read all about it. <laughs> uh, if you if you just missed out on something. And here's everyone's placements. Oh, retro having the most kills. Okay, and district one. All right, I guess we uh my district one. That's awesome. Thank you. And uh. Nilo and Retro went on a killing spree there, and then we got these guys. All right, that's it. That's it. That's crazy. Also, sad to see Zach is the last person. Ah, uh, well, I mean, I guess that's just about it. Anyways, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and um, yeah, roll the outro. Town road, so you know how it goes. But